Very <laughs> funky. Hi, I'm Robert oh. Welsh. <laughs> Whoa, sorry, just that, I didn't realise that. Yeah. your weekly reminder we are not the same person but we both like fooled <laughs> no <laughs> <laughs> we're back and better than ever yeah no we've so much more improved <laughs> we are looking at some tiktok hacks today but we are looking at some food hacks i can't cook i can't cook neither for shit actually for shit yeah i can cook if i'm doing um cat poo on some toast yeah this isn't a sponsor if you've got a voucher code leave it down below for yeah us. let us know wait i have one no, so we're doing some TikTok hacks, food ones. Now there are some crazy things on TikTok. One of my favorite things to watch though is when like a parent gets a big- um, open, open your ears, open your ears. <laughs> gets a big like um, casserole dish mm. and then they put like a, a slab of meat in the middle and, and then cheese it, around And then a block it. of cheese in between. And then they like wrap it up and then they put loads of raw pasta. Yeah. And then they make like this, they make like this bowl of like, I don't know like- They call like a casserole. Yeah, they? but it's just any old shit from anywhere. Yeah. Yeah, it's my favorite thing. I also think like um, TikTok food hacks tend to actually make cooking easier. Unlike five minute crafts where yeah. it just complicates things. Yeah. Like my favorite food hack was the egg in the crisp packet. Wait, wasn't that TikTok? Was that TikTok? Was that, TikTok? Was that five minute crafts? Oh, five minute crafts. Should we watch the hack? Yes. The first hack. Yes, and then to the kitchen. Ooh. Okay. Okay, two, two, two things. Go on. One, not the worst. I don't think this is crazy. No. I do not like heated up fruit. You know, everyone's like, oh, pineapple and pizza. It's not because I think it's crazy, because I don't like warm fruit. Oh, I really want a pineapple pizza now. No, that's a lie. Terrible. I don't think it looks bad. I just don't want to like um, fire the cheese because I'm scared of fire. Oh, we'll just microwave it real quick. Maybe, Maybe we just good. light a match and hold it. Yeah, right yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. We'll figure a way to melt the cheese. I'm actually kind of looking for, I'm intrigued. But let's try and be foodie people. I okay. think the sweetness of the pineapple will taste really good with the shoes. I think the, the, the stringiness of the cheese is going to be quite the contrast Mouthfeel. to the watermelon. Mouthfeel. You said pineapple. It's not uh, pineapple. Mouthfeel. Good mouthfeel. <laughs> Should we, let's have a look. Let's, let's have a look. see. Okay, watermelon oh, pizza. pizza. Let's go. Watch your fingers, please, you horrible boy. <laughs> <gasps> Go on, buddy. Oh my god, this looks like the original watermelons. You know, before they were genetically modified. That's because I grew this one. That's a good, that's a good one. Thank that you, is a good thank slice. you ladies. Okay, so what was the next? We need to fry. Let's put it in a frying pan. The piece, and then we can prepare it in this. That's a good idea. Ba 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 ba. I'm doing a little bit of salt. Also. Oh my god. No. <clears throat> Perry, Perry salt. That'll be okay. nice. Perry salt. I haven't been opened yet. That's oh, it is. Oh. <gasps> we have this. Stacey sent to us. We're just like a puzzler of our toys, aren't we? Okay, because I think it has that nice. <gasps> Yeah, you know, yes. like, like fruit with like spice. Yeah, on. and it blanches it. Blanches it, doesn't it? Is it on? No, I'm prepping it first. Oh. <laughs> Hi, everyone. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna cook the underside, flip this round. just to get that cheese melting. <laughs> wow. No, 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 wait, 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 <laughs> wait. And I'm just gonna let that blanch. Maybe I'll put some more cheese on top so it melts it in. Just a little bit to seal in. I'm just gonna try and help that melt a bit. I've been away, so this is my first time seeing it. <laughs> I, I'm gonna be honest with you, it does look terrible. It smells not great. It sounds like burning cheese. Who's ready for dinner, cats? Yeah. Who's ready for a wet water? Oh, it's really slidey and slippery. Babies. 
You, you've been out all you've day. You've been out playing all day. We're cooking. We're trying to make faces. So, who wants the size? So, who wants the size? I might have to wait for it to um, cool down a little bit. Yeah, we'll wait for it. Because I feel like the water in there is now in the watermelon. It's just boiled and it's literally just going to boil our mouth. That smells fantastic. Yeah. Should we let it like dry? dry I think um, so. Cool down for about an hour. Yeah. Because like you said, it's just boiling water at this point. You know what we need to do? What? Time to try a watermelon pizza. And we, because it's water and we basically cooked it, it's so soggy and wet. I'm gonna try a bit with a fork, I think. How's that pizza? <laughs> oh, is it not good? This is a weird one because yeah. I feel like if that was pineapple, I feel like it'd be more interesting. When it fried, I thought it would get harder, mm. the watermelon, but it just got more wet. Yeah. And like, you know, watermelon's wet. Anyway, it's wild. But it, it became very sloppy and like very like, yeah, not good. It wasn't structured like at all. It felt very, um. but the, the watermelon also didn't add anything. I thought it would add a sweetness yeah, to it yeah. and it add, just added like a watery melon taste. It did, watery melon. Yeah, it wasn't great. It wasn't good. It was difficult to eat. And also as well, because we were kind of like frying it with pepperoni, he kind of got all its grease hanging out and then it was just watermelon water with pepperoni grease and yeah mm. i do have to say like we're not fussy eaters but not that was that literally just tasted like pizza <laughs> it just tasted like wet pizza toppings <laughs> the only reason it tasted remotely similar to pizza was because it had cheese and cheese and tomato, and tomato. i'm gonna i would swap that with pineapple but it still might be floppy so maybe um what's what's fun and healthy cauliflower D no I'm gonna give it a one. I'm gonna give it a one too. Sorry. Okay, okay, next one. Next one. She puts corn syrup into the soda, then adds some green dye, and lastly decides to add some sprinkles for fun. Her friend agrees. Wow, gotta mix up the ingredients. Shake, shake, shake. She puts them in the fridge for a time, then she takes them out of the fridge. You're left with this yummy and gooey soda creation that is sure to please everyone. Yum. Would you try this crazy soda hack? Two things again. One, we don't have a choice. One. Mouthfeel. Mouthfeel. <laughs> I think they'll have a really nice consistency. I think the contrast of the Sprite and the um, sprinkles is gonna make for... <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna make for a really contrasting mouthfeel. Yeah, I, <laughs> I think so too. I'm looking forward to this, but also think it will be too much. Yeah, I think Do it's gonna be... Do we have corn syrup in the UK? Golden syrup, because oh. we don't... I think we didn't we ban corn syrup? Cornstarch. I'm I'm intrigued. Let's see. So we're skipping this one because Ashton made had a go yesterday and it didn't work. It just looks like well, it looks like crap in a bottle. No, that looks revolting. That look, no, that looks like roadside piss. Yeah, like. Oh, it's so funny. <laughs> what a waste of time! And then for it Ashton. exploded everywhere. <laughs> For our poor Ashton, and then it exploded everywhere. Yeah, we didn't waste our time waiting hours for this to work when Ashton mm. knows it didn't already. Yeah. But I do like the look of having like a gummy spray. Gummy, gummy. But we didn't, I mean, we didn't want to waste Ashton's time because it's voluntary taking a year with no pay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, noodles. Okay, noodles, let's go. Fry that. What's that, Nutella? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. No, I don't know. Wait, what are noodles made out of? No, I'm so that's gonna be really good. What are noodles made out of? Um bits. Rice. Bits. <laughs> I feel like a contrasting mouthfeel. That's gonna feel really crazy. Yeah. This is this I feel like this will have a similar taste to chocolate cereal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel <laughs> I, the only thing is, is I feel like noodles are quite watery. Like I over microwave mine because I I like them I like stodgy. Them, I like them to be like a ball of play doh oh. stuck together. Yeah, it's like pick up and go. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Put between two slices of bread. No, yeah. I think I think this will taste nice. Okay, let's try. Let's try. Some new tower. Hey, let's let that boil. Uh. All right. 
We don't have sprinkles, so we're just, just doing this. Do you, want to, do you want to have your first try? I'll have a try. I'm excited for this. Yeah, it's nice and stodgy. Um, uh. What the fuck? What the hell? Oh, fuck. We didn't even put the seasoning in, but I feel like it tastes like the seasoning. That's terrible. I don't mind it, I'm not gonna no, lie. No, why are you going in for so many? I'm just double checking. The, the Nutella's nice. It's very Christmassy. You should start a, um, a store at Christmas market selling this. Is that thing again of it? Just tastes like what noodles is, yeah. with chocolate in it. It doesn't taste nutella -y either though, does it? Yeah, no. I expected a lot more from these you noodles. You ate quite a bit though. <laughs> Did I? You were like, oh, let me eat any Is stuff. there any evidence of this? No. But you did eat quite a, you did, you went back in for a few. Do you know what it was? I think after each mouthful, I was like, oh, actually, maybe that's okay. And then I'd have another lot and be like, oh no, you know what? It's, it's literally just noodles covered in It was chocolate. the noodle texture. I feel like maybe if it was a, a, a thinner noodle. They were softer. Mm. I would rather have porridge with some Nutella whip, like yeah. spooned into it. Yeah. And I feel like that's the satisfaction you get from something like I that. I think that's a very quick student meal. You would have eaten that when you were a student. I literally never had it. I would mix it brie off. into noodles. That's a whole fine. thing of brie. And that's that. disgusting actually. It and that's quite expensive. What kind of budget quite, we Oh no, like Tesco brie. Well, uh, so unfortunately, do you know what? Two, two out of five. I'm gonna give it a one. Cause okay. I didn't like the textures together and I didn't like the taste. Well, actually, it was the taste was okay. It was just the textures together when you like bite down on a noodle. Again, it felt very separate. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. okay, what's next? Rice paper. Again. What are you doing? Crisping them up. <gasps> oh, that looks cute. That looks so good. That actually does look quite good. And you can like season them with whatever. Yeah. <gasps> how, the f how are we going to puff them up? Mouthfeel. Microwave. Microwave. Which is put in the oven. Air fryer. Okay. Try, you know what? We can put some in the oven. And some, some in the air fryer. And some in the air fryer. Let's see how it goes. goes. Um, I think it's going to work. I hope this works. That I looks really good. I think it'll be fine. Let's see. Right, we're doing the rice one now. So I'm just making this not too soggy, just enough to just damp. Fold. Because it's incredibly easy to work with. Then my poo scissors. Oh. <laughs> Very sticky. She must have a lot of skill and patience. <laughs> that looks like a tapeworm. It does. Wow. I'm because yeah. I'm panicking now. Oh. All right. <laughs> Okay, into the air fryer. She well, made them look the so... Did she put them on a tray? Yeah, oh no, she put them on like a little grill thing. Check out on these. Um... They look kind of good. They look like they're on their Some way of them. to doing it. They do smell like they're burning a bit. Yeah, a lot of them look like they just have condensation. I don't think that's yeah. actually. I'm going to film like this because I feel like they're going to deep off. Yeah. Um, and we'll come, we'll check back. We'll let them cool down and come back. <laughs> Why don't you film me? Film the crispy rice. Film me? <laughs> okay, is okay. that still on there? Unseasoned. Unseasoned first. But we just want to see. How's the mouth texture? Mmm, oh no. It's chewy. Chewy, chewy. Oh, no. No. But I guarantee you, we did this wrong. Yeah. Because her yeah. looked really nicely puffed Dry, up. Puffy. Seasoned, yeah. crispy. Mm. And these just taste like a little bit rubbery. Yeah, they do. have another one there. All right. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> get, get in the golden hour. Oh. That's not golden hour, that side. Oh, look, yeah, as you can see all the sun. Say something meaningful. The wind only blows in a place where there's storms, so not all storms are bad because the wind's blowing. 
Okay, I blame us for this one not going well. Yeah, I think it could have done with a lot longer. Maybe not in the air fryer, maybe in the oven, baked them, but maybe. Yeah, I think they need to be baked because they looked crisp, like, try them without any seasoning, which is probably for the best because we can't season anything. I think we gave up because we were like, you know what? These haven't puffed up how we thought they would. There's no point seasoning them because it's not going to add anything. Yeah. But had we had done that properly, there was one really nice, crispy, crunchy there one in there. There was one. That had, I don't know. But had we dipped it in like Potential. salt and vinegar, yeah, yeah, vinegar. it would taste good. Instructions were unclear. Instructions. Yeah, I think it could have potentially been good, but it, it was a lot of prep as well for like just go and buy a packet of something puffed up. You know I, mean? I don't know how much cheaper that would work out actually. Mm. It was a lot of cutting. It was very sticky. It wasn't. It wasn't the best. Yeah. Mm. Last one. Let's see what we have. Hi guys. So today I got two hash brown and an Oreo McFlurry. Um, because I've been seeing this on my for you page for the longest time and I really, really want to try it. You get a hash brown. Nice. A bit more. Sorry. This is really nice. I believe I it. believe it. Let Anything me tell you. Sweet. Go, go on. No, no, go, oh no, please. No, please. I go ahead. Please. 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 Please, please. <laughs> anything like salty, sweet. Yeah, I, I, I love anything. Anything deep fried with a yeah. confectionery. Confection. I really enjoy deep fried, but add a confectionery. And you know what? There's a thing here. I don't know if they do it in the US as well, where people dip their chips or froy into milkshake. Milkshake, yeah. It's really I, good. I believe that will be really, really good. I and really I can't good. wait to feel my heart stop beating for a second as we eat it. Last try. Last try. Oh, right, James, will you do the honor? I'm so excited. No, do I didn't have a Max Crisp. I did put a Ma Max Crisp, but if it was just getting wetter. I think you literally microwave it for like one What's like, couple it's, seconds. It's just, it's just... I just feel like it needs to go on like. No, it doesn't. She just shoved it in between the thing. I don't, I don't like it. <laughs> It's too frozen. It tastes like ice. How can it taste like ice? It tastes like ice cream and hash brown. Yeah. It's not important in terms of taste. It's not like <laughs> bacon and peanut butter kind of yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. What would you say out of 10? Honestly, like a two. Yeah, I'm gonna give it like a four. I'm actually really disappointed. Yeah, me too. I thought this was gonna be really good. Um, very disappointing. Really disappointing. I was expecting, you know what I think what might have made it better would have been the crunchiness of a new hash brown mm. and the warmth maybe with ice cream. You know, when you have like a warm something with ice cream, it's a much better experience. Yeah, yeah. Now it was kind of room temperature chewy hash brown. I feel like it, the hash browns are missing a saltiness that you mm. usually get with mm -hmm. Deep fried stuff, I don't know, do you get yeah, deep or like, I don't know, sweet. there's something that was like, it just felt like two separate things that didn't work together, but it you liked like, both yeah. individually. Just two set, two textures. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not great. Are okay. we rating them out of five? Let's rate them out of five. One, one. I think. Yeah, I think maybe a one. Yeah. I think people are just enjoying it too much. Do you know what? They, these all looked really good. fucking they good. Did. Really good mm -hmm. and really promising. Mm -hmm. I think we, we maybe hyped them all up a bit too much. Yeah. In our heads. So there we go. I feel like we had some amazing looking recipes. We had such a great time. Such a great time that all ended up just being a little bit like, I mean, do you need an you alternative know what? to pizza? <laughs> I mean, if you have to make a pizza, but you have to fry it, I don't think there's any point. No. Um, what was I going to say? None of them were inedible though. That's the thing. A few of them I could go back for a little bit of more I go Like I would go back for the ice cream and the hash brown. Hash brown. Maybe a little, maybe I'll drink the milk from the noodles, you know? Um, and other, yeah, I could go backwards and forwards. Yeah, those crispy things I think would be would have been a nice idea. If somebody made a whole bowl of those and was like, here you go, I'd be like, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. and they were seasoned. I'd be like, yeah. yeah. You know, yeah. But there we go. I'd rate the whole experience to be good. Yeah, medium to good. Yeah. Uh, bear in mind, we don't know how to cook really, so maybe yeah. there's some fundamental skills we were missing throughout. Or maybe not. Maybe we're just good people. Maybe it's know? good people at the end of the day, the and the day. they're not. And they're not. So, so let let's us know see. in the comments. Let's see, Papa. Down below. Down below. Well, I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.